We're witnessing a big change as Boston Dynamics retires its famous robot Atlas. But just as we were about to say goodbye, they surprise everyone with a new generation of Atlas robots made with Hyundai. In a recent video, they also showed Spot, another robot, herding sheep and doing farm tasks. Plus, M-Robot introduced a prototype of a humanoid robot that understands and learns human language. These advancements signal a new era in robotics, blending the end of one era with the start of another. In 2013, Boston Dynamics created Atlas for a U.S. Department of Defense competition. However, the company recently bid farewell to this humanoid robot in a video. Unlike Boston Dynamics' other creations like the robotic dog and bird-like warehouse worker, Atlas struggled to attract buyers' interest. The company hasn't publicly disclosed the reasons behind retiring Atlas, but there are factors indicating the rationality for this decision. For one, Boston Dynamics has shifted its focus towards commercializing its advancements in recent years. Additionally, complex hydraulic robots like Atlas are less favored by buyers due to issues such as leaving hydraulic fluid puddles on the floor. Additionally, Boston Dynamics has found considerable success in selling its robot dog named Spot. Moreover, the field of robotics is actively and effectively progressing towards fully electric androids. It's conceivable that we may witness a new humanoid robot from Boston Dynamics in the future, one that operates without hydraulics yet retains its exceptional capabilities. However, just before we could bid farewell to Atlas, Boston Dynamics pleasantly surprised the robotics community by introducing a new generation of Atlas robots developed in collaboration with Hyundai. This Atlas is a product of decades of research and underscores the company's dedication to creating highly capable and practical mobile robots capable of tackling complex tasks in modern industries. Boston Dynamics states that the new robot is entirely electric with all hydraulic components removed. According to experts at the company, the second generation of Atlas robots is even faster and more agile than its predecessor. The new model of Boston Dynamics robots is set to undergo testing at the Hyundai factory's testing ground. Developers have promised to share more details about the robot and its design in the future. The company claims that it's the most dynamic humanoid robot in the world. But that's not all from Boston Dynamics. Their spot robot was showcased herding sheep, inspecting crops, and relaxing in the grass in a recent video. A New Zealand company called Ross aims to make this a reality. Ross demonstrated how such a device can be used in agriculture. For now, it's a demonstration of capabilities that are expected to be implemented in the future. Ross plans to collaborate with Boston Dynamics to develop a software platform through which the spot robot can perform actions shown in the video. This would enable it to assist in herding sheep, inspecting various crop yields, and creating real-time route maps. According to Ross, Using such robots in agriculture increases food production efficiency, enhances yield estimation accuracy, and reduces the workload on workers. Currently, there's no clear timeline for when the platform will be ready. However, given the capabilities of Boston Dynamics robots, it's entirely possible that the spot can handle such tasks. In related news, MTI Robotics has revealed its first prototype of a two-legged humanoid robot capable of understanding human language and learning. The team is working on developing a humanoid robot that, according to them, will be able to comprehend commands in natural language using artificial intelligence or AI. The Mbot prototype integrates AI at very operational level. Its motion control relies on new machine learning approach known as Sim2Real, where reinforcement learning takes place in a virtual version of the robot. This allows the robot to utilize as much training data as necessary and then react to the real world using minimal data methods. The latest advancements in neural network technology, as seen in NERF, are revolutionizing the representation of 3D scenes by reflecting the world in real time. Semantic knowledge is encoded in these cognitive maps, allowing computers to query them to identify objects and locations. The Menti robot leverages this technology to determine its location on a 3D map and autonomously plan dynamic paths to avoid obstacles. The prototype of Menti robot showcases a complete cycle of performing complex tasks, including navigation, locomotion, scene understanding, object detection and localization, grasping objects, and comprehending natural language. 
However, MCI Robotics emphasized that this is not the final version of the robot, indicating ongoing developments and improvements. The company also revealed that it has initially targeted two main markets for the Menti humanoid robot. One of these markets is the household sector where the robot serves as a domestic assistant capable of navigating through homes and performing various tasks. These tasks include setting the table, cleaning laundry, and learning new tasks through verbal instructions and visual imitation. The second market is the industrial sector, specifically warehouses, where the automated robot is designed for efficient searching, retrieval, and transportation of items. Additionally, it's capable of handling loads up to 25 kilograms. LimX Dynamics, a Chinese company specializing in walking robots, has introduced the four-legged robot W1, which is equipped with wheels at the ends of its legs. The design allows the robot to dynamically combine walking and wheeling, enabling it to overcome obstacles like gaps and navigate stairs. The W1 robot features a built-in surface recognition system that allows it to autonomously switch between different movement. The W1 robot features a built-in surface recognition system that allows it to autonomously switch between different movement modes and adjust its body height and angle relative to the ground during motion. Each leg of the Limb X W1 has a backward bend knee joint and at the end of the each leg is a wheel with an electric motor that can be locked to act as a grippy sole during walking. This configuration enables the robot to seamlessly transition between walking and wheeling, adapting to various terrains. The surface recognition system plays a crucial role in selecting the most suitable movement mode based on the environment. Moreover, the W1 robot can bend its front or rear legs as needed to maintain a horizontal position when traversing inclined surfaces. This feature enhances stability especially when the robot is carrying a load that needs to remain secure during movement. Robomart has developed the world's first autonomous grocery store based on an electric vehicle. The creators of Robomart identified that about 60% of the products sold are perishable goods, with less than 5% of such products sold online. The challenge they faced was that delivering perishable products is costly, and customers often prefer visiting physical stores to select these items themselves rather than relying on unfamiliar individuals to choose for them. The Robomart concept addresses this challenge by allowing allowing customers to summon nearest vans to their home with a simple button press in the mobile app similar to Uber Eats. Upon arrival, customers can open the doors of the mobile store using the app, selecting their desired products and notifying the system when they're done shopping. The Robomart van is fully autonomous without a driver's seat which maximizes the internal space for products. Charging is achieved through wireless charging stations autonomously located by the vans. These vans have a range of 130 kilometers or 80 miles on a full charge and can travel at a maximum speed of 40 kilometers per hour or 25 miles. Researchers from Princeton University in the USA have introduced TiddyBot, a project focused on a personalized assistant bot. This robot comes with features that enable it to classify objects by color, recycle beer cans, tidy up items, and collect trash. The core of the research revolves around customizing home cleaning with the aid of a personal cleaning robot equipped with a manipulator capable of lifting and tidying objects in rooms. A crucial aspect of this robot is determining the appropriate location for each item based on individual preferences which can vary widely depending on personal taste. For instance, one person may prefer storing shirts in a drawer while another may offer a shelf. The researchers demonstrated a system that can learn about user preferences from just a few examples gathered through previous interactions with a specific individual. These preferences are presented as a textual list of objects found in the cleaning area and a list of potential containers where they could be placed. The system then uses a series of commands to indicate where each object should be placed according to users' preferences. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.